Stuart, you recently acquired this uh, HD Heavy Duty XYZ 2 meter machining center, and on it you've got um, a, a very large microlock work holding solution. This has to be the biggest of I've, I've ever seen, but it, it's, it just shows its modularity, doesn't sure. it, this? Yeah, it's uh, four individual plates, but you can build them up as large as you like, and they hold the tolerance, and it's very, very accurate. And, and is that the biggest thing for you, the fact that they hold tolerance, or is there any advantage to you in how quickly it enables you to set your products on here? Sure, because you're programming from known datums, it makes the programming a lot easier, a lot quicker. Uh, we gain advantage by keeping a lot of flatness on our rhythm machines, we use magnetic beds, and it causes us a problem on this with a micro lock, we can get a dead flat first face to work from. I, I look at this and I think you are, you are machining some rather large plate work here and big, big bolsters. Do these clamps have enough clamping force to, you know, to hold those parts? Yes, yeah, yeah, sure, it's definitely, definitely enough. Because you, because you even hold on quite small amounts as well, don't you? Yeah, we do. Yeah, yeah. We have got the uh, the jaws that go on the front as well, so we can hold to the full depth of the bed. Uh, we are looking at riser blocks from Microlock to extend those up as well. And for those people that hadn't seen how the Microlock system works, could you just maybe explain, you know, like for example, you've got locators here in clamps and clamps and how it all goes together? Sure. It works from a, a fixed clamp that can be moved across known datums on the, on the bed. And it also we use these clamps. That is that, is that your locator? Is that the main accurate, where the accuracy comes from? Yeah, these are fixed. The clamps move, these are fixed. And because it's modular, we could put another clamp facing the other way and put more multiple parts on and build it up across the bed. And I think what the, one of the big advantages is as well is you could move that locator right to the back of the plate and know exactly the dimension or where it is in relation to the table, couldn't you? Because uh, it's, it's a precision ground base and you know that each slot is 75 mil next to the other, is that right? That's correct, we know exactly where each datum point is. So that means it's quick to set, you've said it's solid uh, and accurate and it's clamping. It's versatility as well means that you could clamp what? As big a part as you want on this plate? Pretty much, yeah. And you've opted to have this base plate in, the, is there six different plates here? There's four on this four different plates, so you've got four plates here that are basically bolted next to each other. Do you ever envisage taking them off? Uh, no. Let's, let's finally look at return on investment, Stuart, because you, you've, you've invested heavily, not only in the machine, but in the work holding as well. You must have had to have put together some kind of uh, cost-saving proposal. Is there a job that you could give us an example as to how much faster it is with this? Sure, we do one particular large plate, it's precision ground, and before we, had, we didn't have the capacity to machine one face in one go, so there was a lot of flipping them over and trying to match it all up. With this machine, we can get a good flat face. Uh, first time, not a problem. We can leave less on for grinding. Uh, the cycle time is reduced overall from eight hours down to 40 minutes. So, so a massive saving. Then. How many vices have you actually got with the machine as well and locators? We've got 10, 10, 10 vices and five locators at the moment. And do you ever uh, do you use the soft jaws or the hard jaws or serrated jaws as well? Because I know they're adaptations you can add to the microlock system. Yeah, we've, we've used Every, every, every sort of voice and jaw we've had with it, we've used already on various different, different parts. The, the great thing about this is UK manufactured as well, isn't it? Have you, a, a few words on UK manufacturing for this, would you say, uh, if you had to summarise the Microlock solution? It, it's, it's definitely a good achievement for, for the UK. It is. Um, it's good to see engineering picking up as well as it is in the UK. And I, it's also good to see a lot of females now coming up in the engineering. I've actually got a female that works this machine. Really? So. Does she use a Microlock? She uses the microlock, she programs it, and she's, she's not even 20 yet, but 